San Antonio, Texas, third round action of the Valero Texas Open. Cameron Tringali with the 36 hole lead after a bogey early makes the birdie at the fifth and he was happy to see that one go in. Now at the seventh, trying to get to red figures, looking for his first win on tour and nearly 300 starts. He makes the birdie and one under par as he goes out on the front side. Gary Woodland, eight iron at 16, four under par. Woodland to the top half of the green. Beautiful shot, almost an ace. And he would have the tap in birdie to move to five under. Jordan Speed, a lot of support in the gallery for the Texas born star. Makes the putt at nine. He couldn't believe it took that long to get to the cup, but he does gain a shot. 111 coming into 12. And take a look at this from the Spaniard Rafa Cabrero Bello. His second shot, and it is down for an eagle two as he jumps from one over to one under par with one swing. Beautiful shot there, Tom Hoagie. Five under as he looks to finish on the front side. 158 yards, and Hoagie with quite a round. He would finish with five straight birdies coming in, a total of nine birdies on the card. Charlie Hoffman, five under. Last win was right here at TPC San Antonio and attacking at the par 5 14th from 234 yards. This one climbing the slope and he would have an eagle putt from there jumping to seven under. Jordan Speed in the fairway at 12, 84 yards and that one dancing all around the flag coming down the slope. He would leave it in birdie range if he would convert the putt. He was in the Final grouping, along with England's Matt Wallace. Wallace looking for birdie at 12. Downhill play, 16-footer. That's in. And Wallace in search of his first win on the PGA Tour. Back to Hoffman for birdie at 16. And he adds another to the card. Hoffman with confidence stroking these putts. And he's at a place where he's won before, so really starting to zero in. Now it's 17, shorter par four, 17 footer, that one drops. And so he would get to nine under par. Now Matt Wallace for birdie at 15, on the green, good look, and a straightaway putt from 17 feet. And he would get to 10 under and tie Hoffman for the lead. And now Speed also to grab a share. And that one's in. Jordan Speed's last win was in 2017 at the Open, and he is determined to get back to the winner's circle. Look at this off of a very tough lie. And he leaves it just a couple of feet from the cup, and he gets to 1100.